morning from Fontana. I'm Betsy Wong. I'm the Artistic Administrator of Fontana. And sitting across the table for me is David Baldwin, Artistic and Executive Director. And we're here to talk to you a little bit about our upcoming 2016-17 season, for which we are extremely excited. Indeed. Good morning, David. Good morning. Do you want to start us off with our opening concert? Sure. On September 24th? Yes, September 24th at Western Michigan University's Dalton Center Recital Hall at 7.30. And it is the great jazz pianist Brad Meldow and the great jazz saxophonist Joshua Ripp. And we're excited to have them together. Um, it's been a number of years since they've worked together, although back in the 90s they worked um, in each other's ensembles quite a bit. Um, but it'll be the first time that they're getting together as a duo of quite some time, and it's very exciting for us. Oh, it'll be great. We're really looking forward to it. Should be a should be a sellout crowd. Um, can you tell us anything about the artists? Like, you know all these guys. So. Yeah, no, it's, it's really interesting backstories there. Um, Josh Redman uh, had gone to Harvard as an undergrad, and he studied uh, social studies. There. He graduated as a social studies undergrad. And he had been accepted to the Yale Law School. Wow. So yeah, pretty impressive stuff. <laughs> yeah. And deferred for a year, because um, he had a bunch of friends from um, the Berkeley College of Music in Boston that he used to play jazz with. And so all of them sort of migrated to Brooklyn just to kind of see if they could have a go of it gigging and everything else. And uh, he never looked back. So he never went to law school, and he's been um, a full-time jazz musician ever since. That's so incredible to pass up a law degree at Yale. For something you love. <laughs> for something, you know, I think that's the, that's the way sure. you should do it. Sure. You know, as sure. we keep saying, um, I'm a flutist, and you're a pianist, yes. and I wouldn't have had it any other way. How about you? No, I don't think I would either. I, I, yeah. And we need people on both sides of the stage. We do. Um, and Brad has been with the Gilmore as he well was, in recent yeah, years. Yeah, uh, two, festival, two festivals ago, I think 2012, um, right, in right. a couple of different guises. I think one with his trio, and then mm -hmm. there was another collaborative thing that he was doing. Um, and he's not only a terrific pianist, he's also a composer, and he's written for lots of, of course, jazz musicians, but even classical musicians such as Jeremy Dank and Renee Fleming. Oh, yeah, and I would love to get my hands on his, he wrote a concerto called The Brady Bunch Variations. For piano and orchestra, yeah. yes, I would love to get my hands on that too. <laughs> it's it's got to be a really interesting piece. I, I actually kind of looked around on the internet to see if I could could find a, a video clip. Well, we'll have to ask him when he's here. Yes, 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 maybe he'll take some requests. Sure. sure. <laughs> he can play a clip. Uh, it'll be a great and exciting concert. I'm looking forward to it. Should be good. Should be good. And, and again, stressing that that concert begins at 7.30. All of our concerts this season yes. will be at 7.30. As opposed to 8 o'clock, which we've done traditionally, so yes. Right, I think 7.30 is a good starting. Uh, yeah, it helps. Um, you know, we have a lot more people coming in from out of town right now, mm -hmm. um, and so as that audience develops, we want to give them a little extra chance to get home afterwards and not be too late. And so I think it's, it's a civilized good time. Well, I think so too. So Brad Meldow and Josh Redman, September twenty fourth, two thousand sixteen, seven thirty p.m. at Dalton Recital Hall. <laughs> 